speed of sound Got places to go, gotta follow my rainbow Can't stick around, gotta keep moving on Guess what lies ahead, only one way to find out Oi! Come on Sonic, it wasn't that bad! Seriously! You hear a lot worse on X Factor Hey guys and girls, and welcome to part 17 of Let's Play Sonic Generations Non-Blind. In the last episode, we went through all of Act 1's, uh, 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 fuck, what's the name of this zone again? Um, no, not Crisis City, uh, City Escape, that's the one. Uh, <laughs> we went through all of that, uh, Challenge Gates, and in this episode, we're get uh, what the? Did you see that? <laughs> Sonic was rotating while still lying down. Oh my god, that was, that's fucking terrible. He's doing it again. Oh man, I, I could I could sit here and just experiment with this all day long, but that's uh, what that's 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 really weird. That's really odd. Um, okay, yeah, and uh, what was I saying? Uh, yes, in this episode we're going to be doing. Um... <laughs> I can't get over that. Oh, I'm going to wait for it to lie down again. I'm, I'm, I'm really sorry, guys. Uh, in this episode, we'll eventually be doing the Act Two mission gates, but I want to see him lying down again. What the fuck? I mean, really? Oh my god! Oh, I think that's been the highlight of the episode so far for me. Uh, yeah, so let, let, let's begin with Act 1. No, uh, well, sorry, uh, Challenge Gate number 1. Let's get this, this uh, music changed because in my practice run, I was actually using Rune 99 and it worked quite well. So, so I'm kind of grateful we unlocked that one we did. So here we go. Okay, this is challenge gate number one, Cream and her helping hand. Make your own jokes. Okay, the idea behind um, behind this uh, challenge is that uh, Cream has five chow circling you, and they give you uh, a ring whenever you need it, because there is literally only one ring in this entire level, and that's the current ring that I have that I just simply collated from um, the start. However, there are benefits to keeping all five chow there, which hopefully I'll be able to uh, demonstrate at the end of the level. There really is practically no point in going for those jumps because you can't, for whatever reason, you cannot replenish your uh, boost meter, so you've got to use that sparingly. And that is literally all you've got, so... I hope I don't press the Y button by accident. I quite like Rune 9 on this, it kind of works. And um, that's not what I was going for, but you know, never mind. Ooh, thank goodness for that. I was gonna go in the pit. Oh that's handy. Oh come on, I went for it. I certainly don't want to get impaled by a bit of spike, so let's just go along here. Bam! <laughs> I sometimes forget that the uh, enemies back into each other. Ah, oh, Horlicks! Quick, let's get that ring. I want that ring. I want to keep the, me five chow. Um, okay, I'm not even going to... I'm going to try not to question why I was unable to pick up that ring. It's just more wonderful game design there by Sonic Team. Thanks a lot. <laughs> I'll do fine using the boost on that particular... Oh! And there we go, guys. That! is why you want to keep as many chow as possible because they give you minus five clocks at the end of the stage, so yeah. It's a benefit to trying to keep a hold of that single ring that you started off with. Ah, celebratory sip of tea and let's see what our reward is. Zoom out so we can see where it goes. Oh, goody gumdrops, another piece of artwork. Oh! Right, let's go back down. Um back up that way because I did say in the uh, last episode that I was going to do the, uh, the, um, the challenge gates in order so let's start off with challenge gate number two we haven't got any more music so much just keep it as it is okay this is challenge gate number two dash ring one two three and the idea behind this one is that you've got 35 dash rings to go through, and you have to go through all of them. You cannot miss a single one, otherwise you'll fail the mission. This one isn't really that bad. I mean, you can generally get a good rank on your first go. 
it isn't too hard to um it isn't too hard to um, go through all the rings. It's actually quite hard to miss the ball, so if you somehow manage to miss the ball, miss the ball, then you really need to have a word with yourself. Uh, there's no, no, of course, there's a clock up there. That's why I was hesitating around the area. No, there was always something there, but I can never ever remember that it was a clock. Take my Set you free. I, I, I don't know, I don't mind the uh, modern version of um, Escape from the City that much. Whoa. There we go. I was hoping I was going to make that in one piece. Let's see, we've got uh, 12, so 30 to go. Oh, I had a feeling that was going to happen. I hate it when that happens. Right, let's try that again. There we go. Let's see what we're up to uh, one, one, one minute seven. Should be able to do it now. Just jump straight up and boom! There we go. Thankfully, this uh, this uh, ring mission is a hell of a lot better than any of the other ring missions in Sonic 06. Those weren't all too bad, but they were kind of pointless. Let's check out our reward. Oh, you bastard! You went the other way. Gotcha. Right there, right on! Oh yes, I'm so using that. Oh, this might actually be quite appropriate. Yeah, I love this tune, it's brilliant. It's one of the reasons why I play Sonic um, Sonic Rush. Okay, this is challenge gate number three, Topsy Turvy. Uh, in this uh, challenge, you've got rotating wheels and handles. Uh, uh, well, you, you'll see. Those things there, the bars. Right there, right on, right there, right on, right there. Um, sorry, I try not to sing too much. Oh, nice! I normally like to hit that platform at 30 seconds. Ah, oh, come on, I want... Come on, let's do this! Yes, 46 seconds! I am fucking having that! <coughs> Excuse me. That's a real shame, really, because I was enjoying listening to Ride There, Ride On. Oh, we've got to keep going though. As much as I'd like to keep listening to that, we've got to keep on moving. Let's see what our reward is. I bet it's going to go the other way. What? Well, nope, it's going the way we want it to. Ah, fuck a doodle do. So well, let's try and go for it again. There we go. Right, challenge game number four. I don't think we've got any appropriate music for this one, so let's just keep going. Okay, this is challenge gate number four, High Speed High Jinx 2. Enemies move at double the speed. And they move and shoot at double the speed, I should say, so be on your guard. Hopefully, with any luck, I can get through this without too many problems. You should see my practice run of this. I was effing and blinding everywhere. I was like, how the fuck does that work? I was like to slow down at this point because Sonic in his boost form, it just doesn't work on that area just before the loop. It just doesn't. He just floats around everywhere, sort of wondering, what the fuck am I supposed to do now? Lucky. Oh. See, was thinking about that. I like this bit here because you got a boost and slide at the same time. And I managed to do it. Fantastic. Right, guys, I'm going to show you a little something here. Watch everything around the goal ring. Right? Here we go. And it all just implodes and sucks in with the goal ring. Almost as if it went into the special stage. <laughs> Uh, well, we've got one more um, one more challenge to do, and we all know what that is. 
behind someone's just come along on Skype. Let's see, uh, let's see what we got. Oh, new music! A new venture. I can't even remember what that's from, what that sounds like, or any, any other that lovely bollock. So let's have a quick... Let's have a quick gander. Uh, a new venture. I don't, I don't know what this one. I guess I'll find out in a, in a, in a, bit, in a little while after I've done the uh, special. Um, once I've done challenge game number five, I'll quickly take a, the peek in the music room. <coughs> so we'll just keep it. Uh, no, we won't keep it at normal background music. What am I doing? Um, Super Sonic Racing. Because I still don't have uh, Let the Speed Mend It unlocked. You guys could probably imagine the excitement that I'll uh, suddenly reach when I when I get the musical note and I unlock Let the Speed Bend it. I'll be like, yeah, boy! <coughs> yeah, I should do that. Anyway, here we go, doppelganger race. Like you guys didn't know. こちらの機体位置を確認した。捕獲した破裂海の状況を報告せよ。現況報告。現在移送中の容疑者は。どうした？破裂海行くぜ。登場者仲間が全員。どうした？おお。やめろ。早まるな。こっちに来るんだ。
And I'm about to run out of boost. Oh, maybe not actually. <laughs> See, I've got 15 seconds to get me S rank. Should be able to do it. There we go. <coughs> Yay, new record. So all in all, I don't reckon that was a bad episode today. I actually managed to perform better than I expected. Or rather, I performed two expectations because I wanted to uh, get the S ranks on every single one. A couple of mistakes here or there, but sometimes that's just the LB curse fucking about with you. So um, let's quickly find out what we unlocked. Oh, goody gum drops, more artwork. So, we're coming back down. Alright guys, there's only one section left to go for challenge gates. And that is Seaside Hill. I can't really say it's um, my overall favourite because I don't really play Sonic Heroes that much. In fact, I can't remember the last time I played it. So, um, yeah, guys, uh, until next time, take care of yourselves and thanks for watching.